Hi, I'm going to start with a scripture from the book of John. As the Father has loved me, so have I loved you. Abide in my love. If you keep my commandments, you will abide in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandments and abide in his love. These things I have spoken to you, that my joy may be in you and that your joy may be full. I'm now going to read a story called Full and Complete Joy. It is usually difficult to find a joy in the small, mundane things of life and nearly impossible when painful events crash into our lives. A recent movie related the true story of small miracles that occurred after the tragic accident of a young child. Although unseen at the time, each decision, each step, and each person involved in the journey toward healing became exposed. What seemed haphazard to them at the time gave place to the joy of a complete restoration of health procured by God alone. In Psalm 43, verse 5, King David shared his trust. Why are you cast down? O oh, my soul, and why are you in turmoil within me? Hope in God, for I shall again praise him, my salvation and my God. It is when earthly joy is lacking that true joy is discovered, for it rests in who Christ is, our salvation and our Redeemer. It is exposed in what he did through his death and resurrection. His joy can fill us in the midst of tragedies, for he remains our light and our hope even in dark times. He understands and he cares, for he is our joy. Let us pray. Jesus, while we may feel no joy for our circumstances, help us to find joy in the circumstances, for our hope is in you alone. Amen.